How's it going, everybody? C Rad TV back here again. It is NBA draft night. The Pistons are about to be on the clock with the 15th pick. And if anyone's wondering, yes, I did finally get a haircut. Finally happened a lot longer than expected. But yeah, uh, surprisingly, everyone's passing on the Cyril Little. And I think we've already heard from Ed Stefanski. Their Pistons are going to take the best player available. The Pistons also own the um, Milwaukee's first round pick. Because we finally traded John Willard's bum ass to the Bucks, And we got Tom Sneal and a the 30th pick. So whoever Milwaukee takes with that pick at the end of the first round is going to become a Piston. But yeah. I really like that trade a lot. Really like it. I'm really shocked that we got a first rounder for John Luer. Like, I'm not sure what the fuck the Bucks were thinking giving us a first rounder for John Luer. Like, god damn. That's just some dumbass shit there. But yeah, honestly, I'm looking at all the pit players here available. Pistons looking like they're taking the best available. I'm thinking it's going to be Nasir Little. I don't see how the Pistons pass on Little. Like... Like you're obviously in win now mode with Blake Griffin, Andre Drummond, and Reggie Jackson. Like you gotta give them weapons to work with. And oh, by the way, the pick is officially in. While wow, we're having all that happen, that's sorry about that. That's my cat over there, Allie, trying to get out. So I we'll have to see how this goes. So yeah, I have the TV mute so I can speak. So let's unmute. So we're gonna see what we're growing here. I'm thinking it's gonna be Nasir Little. Like, out of all the players the Pistons interviewed leading up to the draft and worked out, Nasir Little was the best player they interviewed and worked out. And we're in commercial break. So we're not going to find out this pick for like another minute or so. But, uh, yeah. You know. You know, we just got to build around Griffin and all of them. And, yes, I am wearing a Blake Griffin jersey, if anyone's wondering. So, yeah, I'm not going to be able to react, though, to the 30th pick, sadly. Because after this, I gotta start getting ready for work. Since I'm working midnights, but damn. Yeah, so let's just wait here until commercial's done with. But I am doing an NHL draft pick reaction for for the NHL draft tomorrow. When the Red Wings pick six overall. So yeah, this is gonna be interesting. What happens here. But yeah, while well, we just wait. Just waiting patiently. God damn long ass commercial breaks. Oh yeah, and I am watching on the Canadian feed, so and they're showing election commercials. Just saw one of the Justin Trudeau ones where they said Trudeau's not ready. <laughs> and oh by the way, this is gonna be the first Canadian federal election I'm actually gonna be eligible to vote for. So how about that? We just wait in, just wait in, just goddamn wait in. Hurry the fuck up, please. I want to find out what this pick is before I gotta go to work. Come on, man, please hurry up. The suspense is killing me on the inside. Come on. Come on. I'm now running out of lyrics to say for my song I just made. Just please hurry up. My cat did finally get out of the room. It's okay, I got my cat Bubba on the sh my clothes shelf way over there. Come on, hurry up. Yeah, this is what happens when you make C-Rad TV wait during the draft. I do all kinds of stupid shit, including singing. <sighs> Come on. Oh, here we go. Alright, draft's back the on. Who is it going to be? I don't see how it's not Nasir Little. I think it's going to be, I think it's got to be Little. And usually we've seen a lot of great players come out of 15th pick. Like, 15th pick was... We've seen Kawhi Leonard go out of 15 pick. We saw in Giannis. I'm not going to even attempt saying his last name because it's a goddamn tongue twister. Uh, Conor Matuna 
Come on, Tupolo. Monte Acupolo. There we go. I think I said it right. Sorry if I said it wrong. You know, a lot of great players come out at the bottom half of the draft. So we're now entering the second half of the draft. So who will it be? Oh, here we go. With the 15th pick in the 2019 NBA Draft, the Detroit Pistons select Sekou Dubuya. Oh, so they passed on this year a little too. They took Sekou, Sekou Dubuya. Duamboya. There we go. I think I, I just need a second attempt to say his last name. They took the foreigner out of France. Mm. Wow. I'm not sure why everyone's passing on the Sear Whittle. Huh. I mean, we did need we do need play, talent around Blake Griffin. Hmm. Let's see. This was somebody the Pistons didn't even really interview. Interesting pick. Hmm. Gonna need some time to think about this one. Huh. Let's see. Really good shooter. Oh, compared to Siakam. Hmm. So we got another version of Pascal Siakam. Hmm. Let's see it. 6'9. Ooh, that's a big. Really broke out on the FIBA circuit mm, with the not bad. 18 European Championship national team and really playing well next to Frank Nilekina. Had a tremendous showing there, led the team in scoring, and then from there has mm. really emerged. Had a tremendous season Let's with see. Limoges in France this past season. Uh, you know, he played great in France, Pro A, played, played great in the Euro mm. Cup, and this is a guy with high upside. He's an NBA caliber athlete, he's improved as a perimeter shooter. Oh, nice. Solid pickup. I'll take it. I'll take it. He was the next best player after Nasir Little, so I'll take it. Solid pick, I'll take it. What's he already says say? Okay, you've only been playing basketball for six years. How do you become good enough to be drafted in the first round? Only six years? Hmm. So, his best years are still ahead of him. Hmm. Just work. A lot of work. A lot of work in the gym. A lot of sacrifice. And that's it. Thanks for your time, thank you. Congratulations. All right. So, I'll pick up. I'll take it. I'll take the pick. So yeah, I'm gonna. I now gotta get start getting ready for work now. You know, I might. I might talk about who the who is who the Bucks take at thirty, because whoever the Bucks take at thirty is gonna end up becoming a piston as a result of the lure trade. But yeah, folks, that's my reaction there. Hope everyone has a great day. I'll see you all for the Red Wings draft reaction tomorrow. Peace.